In this video we share Our Lady's message to Pedro Regis for January 9, 2024. Please like, comment and subscribe to assist my channel to grow as I share these messages with a wider audience. Thank you. Our Lady's message to Pedro follows here. Dear children, have ye courage, faith and hope. In the midst of the great tribulation, the Lord will make arise men and women of faith who will defend his holy name. Do not stay stationary in sin, but serve the Lord with joy. The demon divides by bringing the lie among my poor children, but in the truth of the gospel and the teachings of the true magisterium of the church of my Jesus ye will find the way to heaven. Fear ye not. Whoever is with the Lord will never be defeated. Everything that is false will fall to the ground. Onward. My Jesus is in control of everything. Stay with him. Love ye and defend the truth. Do not forget, your goal must be the heaven. This is the message that I transmit to you today in the name of the Most Holy Trinity. Thank you for having allowed me to reunite you here once more. I bless you, in the name of the Father, of the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Stay in peace. Our Lady Queen of Peace gave a similar message to Pedro Regis on the Feast of All Saints, November 1, 2022. That message follows here. Dear children, God is the Lord of your lives. Trust in Him and you will be victorious. Tell everyone that God is making haste and that this is the time of the great return. Do not fold your arms. Proclaim Jesus to all those who are far away. Love and defend the truth. The silence of the righteous strengthens the enemies of God. You are living in the time of the great tribulation, and only those who walk the path of truth will remain firm in the faith. I am your mother, and I want to see you happy here on earth, and later with me in heaven. Whatever happens, stay with Jesus and defend the teachings of the true magisterium of his church. Dispel the darkness of error with the light of truth. You are heading toward a future in which the truth will be ignored by many consecrated people. Spiritual blindness will spread everywhere. Go forward on the path that I have pointed out to you. This is the message that I give you today in the name of the Most Holy Trinity. Thank you for having allowed me to gather you here once more. I bless you in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Be at peace. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.